direction. A 21-year-old man was shot at 18th and Locust Friday afternoon around 12.30 p.m. Police said the victim, identified as Darren Jenkins, was shot during an altercation and died from his injuries. Welcome to my world. Welcome to my reality. My name is Robbie, and I'm 17 years old. And I've attended more visuals of homicide victims than I have days of school, it seems. I don't understand. I was just laughing with my cousin the day before he died. They say he got into some beef with some guy over nothing. Shots was fired. Darren died. I just can't take this no more. There is a time for everything and the season for every activity under the heavens. There's a time to be born and a time to die, a time to plant and a time to uproot, a time to kill and a time to heal, a time to tear down and a time to build, a time to weep and a time to laugh, a time to mourn and a time to dance, a time to scatter stones and a time to gather them, a time to embrace and a time to refrain from embracing. A time to keep and a time to throw away. A time to tear and a time to mend. A time to search and a time to give up. A time to love and a time to hate. A time for war and a time for peace. A time to be silent and a time to speak. 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 Power to the streets, death before dishonor. They want to see me locked up. I'm innocent, your honor. Whole streets, our streets. Time to take the streets back. America's worst nightmare, young countries in black. I got the spirit of a panther, but violence ain't the answer. It calls Dr. King his life. He threw rocks at Jesus Christ. Death before the sun, I was born to be a king. A modern day soldier, time to take the game over. They don't get power to the streets. Death before dishonor. They want to see me locked up. I'm innocent, your honor. Whole streets, our streets. Time to take the streets back. America's worst nightmare, young countries. Punches in black. I got the spirit of a panther, but violence ain't the answer. It calls Dr. King his life. They threw rocks at Jesus Christ. Death before the sun, I was born to be a king. A modern day soldier, time to take the game over. They don't get power to the streets. Death before the sun, they want to see me locked up. I'm innocent, your honor. Whole streets, our streets. Time to take the streets back. America's worst nightmare, young punches in black. I got the spirit of a panther, but violence ain't the answer. It calls Dr. King his life. They threw rocks at Jesus Christ. Death before the sun, I was born to be a king. A modern they soldier time to take the game over they don't get power to the streets death before dishonor they want to see me locked up i'm innocent your honor whole streets our streets time to take the streets back america's worst nightmare Young every voice and sing every voice and sing till earth in heaven bring with us You was getting it. You upset about your cousin? Yeah. Two murders last night, five the night before that. Things will get better. Yeah, as soon as the first snowflake sets, the killer's arrest. Hey, you can turn your tragedy into art. Lift every voice and sing. Why don't you just try to think positively about getting out of this place? Don't bring up Juilliard again. I told you. After my cousin, I just can't leave the neighborhood right now. I gotta do something. Yeah, you can sing. You can inspire and make a change that way. That's a gift from God right there. It's been a tough year so far. Just take your pain and pour it into the song. The greatest art in history was created that way. Yeah, well they ain't have to deal with the dang war zone outside their front door. Use it. Put that in the song. Let our rejoicing rise high as the listening sky. JR, man, why you just barging into my house like that? 
What if I would have thought you was a robber or a thief? I would have shot your sorry butt. Well, how are you not smart enough to lock your doors in this neighborhood? It's your house. You should have locked it. Anyway. Girl, where was you at? We outside waiting on you. Oh, I am so sorry, JR. Let me finish up here and then I go home, change real quick. Come out there and light you up. Mm-hmm. Yeah, all right. Lock up behind me, Jerome. Get your sorry butt out of here, man. You're right, man. I'm sorry. Man. Oh, wow. <laughs> man, lock the door behind you. You lock the door behind you. Dude is obsessed with you. Because we playing ball. You just jealous. You think I want your big head butt? Anyway, I got to go hoop. Let's start this up tomorrow around 4 o'clock. Or like 4 or 4 like 6. Shut up, Rooms. For like 4 p.m., 1,600 hours. All right. Lock the door. Shut up. Hey, Earl. What's up, Robin? I know you're going to sing at my next barbecue. If you cooking, I'm singing. And you know this, Robin. <laughs> around 6 p.m. Friday near Sherman and Burleigh. One man was killed at that location, according to the medical examiner. Police say the victim... Hey, baby, you bring me my pop and peanuts. ...identified as Stephen James, who was driving on Sherman when he was shot. The circumstances are still under investigation. It was another violent summer weekend in the city of Milwaukee. Hey. Milwaukee police confirmed that at least two of the shootings over the weekend involved victims that are children under the age of 10. Lord, please let winter come early this year. Hey, fool, you ready? What up? Let's get it. Let's get it. Oh, he weak. I bet you can't hold me. And his baby mama with five kids with no time to go to work. But now it's my time to go to work. And know that I shine in a Get on them. And y'all think y'all cold, but y'all not. Y'all can get off my court. 
Remember what happened last time, boy? Yeah, and your sister do too. Oh! <laughs> hey, no, bro, what's up with you and Robbie? The same thing that's up with me and your mom. Man, stop playing. Mom and I play. You yeah, tripping. Right. Yeah, but they not. Hey, they, they here. No. Got you, boss. Hello, Robbie. Hey, Jack. Hey. Sorry about your cousin. Any suspect? Nobody's talking, as usual. How much? Oh, here. You can just have it. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Later, Jackie. After a while, Robbie Dial. You ready? Oh, I'll be there in 10 minutes. You for real? Sorry, I have to get Grimm's start popping peanuts. Couldn't text your brother? Don't give me that. All right, come on. <laughs> what you know about this three-pointer right here? I know you're not standing back far enough to count that baby shot as a three-pointer. Oh, you got jokes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Let me show you what wet looks like. Yeah. <laughs> Again? Girl, been playing all day waiting on you. But you can show me some love. Now, I told you, you a beast on the court. Don't forget about the hood when you make it out to the WNBA, you feel me? Nah, these hands was meant for playing the piano, and this voice was meant for singing. I just like making you sweat. <laughs> <laughs> Man, love, I feel you. Look, I'm sorry about your cousin, Vision. I just couldn't go and see his mama and his little sister hurting like that. I just couldn't do it. I'm sorry. It's all good, J.I. So, you want to go to dad's party tonight? We got school tomorrow. It's not a party party. You know, it's just friends hanging. You know these fools got guns. Ah! Why are you so mad you had kicks in there? Come on, we gotta go to the police. Come on, fool. Oh, you had stuff in there. You can't hide anything from me, JR. Everybody knows. It's only weed and I only sell to friends. What kind of drug did it leave his stuff in a backpack like that? You know what? I gotta find that bag. JR, don't. What's up, girl? What on earth is this on your head? <laughs> My uniform. <laughs> Lord knows it's a crying shame how they killed our Darren like that. What did that child ever do to anybody? I tell you, the streets don't love nobody. That child is gone far from here, way before his time. It ain't right. All these mamas burying their babies. Baby, are you all right? She all right, mama. We all right. Got no choice but to be all right. Robbie, honey, when I was your age, we were safe in these streets. We would sit on the porch, walk around all day, all night. And there weren't no gunshots everywhere. I wish you lived in those good old days. People actually loved each other. And their neighbors would discipline each other's kids. They'd drag you home by your ear if they need to. <laughs> then you get home. Mama whoop your butt. 
<laughs> That's right. But we had love and respect for each other. Some young generation don't know nothing about. But if we had drama, oh, trust and believe, we handled our business. But this right here, what we used to use. Ugh. Keisha, what? Keisha, why are you so dramatic, child? Well, whose child am I, hmm? Oh, mama, you know that's how we used to get down back in the day? When nobody walking around carrying guns, shooting up everybody they didn't like? Oh, but the Lord, he about to come, no doubt. Because I'm sure he can't take much more of this mess. Why not show? Sure can't wait till he come. Because I'm tired of living my life like this. I want to get out of here, you know, mama? I'm tired of wondering who's next. Maybe even me. Baby, you know, I remember when I was a child growing I up. I love my Auntie Keisha we never and my Grandma Hattie. Stay the best people I know. But why my mama have to die just for me to be born? And where's my dad? Who is my dad? I don't know if mama would have shared that with Grams. She might have shared it with Auntie Keisha though, but I have yet to ask her. And she never volunteered to tell me. She said the reason why she ain't got no kids is because I cried so much as a baby. That made her infertile. Come on. Good evening, ladies. Sorry to bother you, but did you hear the gunshots last night? Yeah, we heard them. We heard them last night, the night before that, the day before that, and twice the night before that. You ain't hear them? We understand, but did you see anything in connection with the men that were shot last night? I guess that's what we're asking. I can give you a detailed description of the flow, because that's all we saw when we dove to the ground. Thank you for your time, ma'am. Well, I'll be thanking you just as soon as those hoodlums are caught and we can leave our houses again. Matter of fact, when I was young, police used to be in the neighborhood handing out baseball cards to the kids. Y'all got baseball cards? It's some kids right there. Standing in the graveyard. So many, many dead when the cats get to popping. They aiming for your head. Holler when I come through. Better break bread every time I watch the new. Another brother dead. Oh, yeah. We got the beast high in the foreman race. And we gotta eat riding through them blocks. Shots ring out. Little kids getting shot. Sitting in the house. They told me that the grind was greedy. Now I run the city if you want to take the throne. Come and come and get it. God. Busting down for Gucci, man. Love, where are you? You seem to come and go. I try so hard to see you. I need to know. Were you there with me and my mother? Were you there with my mother and father? I need them now. I need their love. It's just not the same down here. When your love is above up there, I need that contact. I need their touch. There's just too much I am missing. They're hugging, they're kissing. They're assuring me. He'll protect you. If only you knew. Do you know? Do you know how it feels to not see you in the eyes of those who have no reason to hate me? Do you know how it feels to finally realize that you who made me may have turned your face away from us? How I long for that day for us when your children receive what we are missing. And I feel you and your hugging and your kissing, assuring me I protected you. But is it only then I will truly see? Eyes up front, I need your attention, please. Class has started, thank you. All right, Rob. Robbie, <laughs> good morning, sunshine. Thank you for joining us. I want you all to take out your essay notebooks and a pen or a pencil, because today we're going to have some fun with creative writing. Well, don't everybody look so happy? Come on. You'll love this, I promise. OK, I want the whole entire class to close your eyes. Uh, yes. So, Ms. Collins, for the first time, you actually want us to close our eyes? Yes, really. Man, okay. This is a really. Good night. All right. No sleeping though, especially a certain somebody with a cat. This would okay? be weird. I want you to imagine this. All right. Come on. Settle down. Okay. Here we go. Eyes closed. No peeking. 
I'm checking you. No, Hello, no, thank no, you. I want you to imagine that you're no longer in high school. You're an adult. You've graduated high school, you're done with college, and you're working in your profession. You're happy, you have your whole lives ahead of you. Think of the possibilities. There are no limitations in this classroom today. Let your mind take you anywhere you want to go. What are your dreams and your hopes and your aspirations? What do you want to accomplish in life? It's been a journey and I made it. I had a dream and I'm living it. I got the penthouse and the hotel. All my friends on my your eyes. Well, how was that? Oh, come on, guys. I want some feedback. I want to hear what you thought about. It was a nice nap. <laughs> okay. I'm going to give you a few minutes to write down everything. Hurry before you forget. Yes. I was a chemist. Good. Very good. In the kitchen. <laughs> okay. Well, maybe you have children. It could be anything. I want to know everything. Write it all down. Yes, JR. Why you got us imagining things that'll never be? What do you mean? You can be and do anything that you want. For real? Yes. You don't see nobody missing today? We only have three people absent today. We're doing very well. <laughs> Danielle, Tori, Ricky, Mikey, Willie, T, and that's just the dude. Okay. Toya, right. Jasmine, Ebony, Kiki. Kiki. Mookie. Mookie. Lanisha. Dot. Right. Dot. Okay, that's James enough. James B. James R. Latrell, Desmond, Jayla. Okay, please. Darion, Pristine, Smurf. Okay, that Smurf is enough, is guys. Move. Please. What are you saying, JR? That there's no hope for any of you? Is that what you really think? Is that how you really feel? Is that how you all see your future? Yeah. Look, uh, Ms. Collins, we in a war but we don't know who we fighting or why. We keep getting shot and killed every single day. Oh. Last night, me and my little brother slept on the floor again because it sounded like they were shooting right outside of our window. They were. The board on our fence between our house got holes in it. <laughs> see? But you want us to see us as adults. I see me maybe making it to be an adult. 
But I see me out cold in a coffin. Don't say that. A blue one with silver trimming and white interior. This ain't JR, no. My mama gonna put me in a blue suit because she know that's my favorite color. All my friends are gonna cry for me. Y'all gonna cry for me? Probably. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, this isn't a joke. There will be a tree memorial for me with teddy bears and balloons. My little brother is gonna miss me. My face is gonna be on everybody's oversized tee with rest in peace written all fancy on it. Don't say that. And then at the end of it all, my killers? Y'all already know. Nobody saw nothing. Oh. They not finna get caught, Miss Collins, even though they'll be right there at the services. <laughs> I want a red casket with silver chrome. Get out. That's not funny, <laughs> Oscar. <laughs> man, I don't know about y'all, man, but I want a silver and black casket. Got a little body behind. Uh, was... Telling you, man, I look good in a silver and black That's casket. Enough. <laughs> That's enough. That's not be funny. Ugly. <laughs> <laughs> she knows. Tell <laughs> Well, I want white. White everything. You feeling godly, Robert? Right, you knew that. <laughs> white Bobby. dress. I ain't selling out of nothing. I just like white. I just think white makes sense for a funeral. I mean, we all going where everything is white. That's why you wear blue, You know, cause. please, can't believe what... <laughs> oh, my God, dear God, I can't believe what I'm hearing. You're, you're only 17, and you're talking about coffins and funerals and memorials? How many of you don't think that you're going to see the age of 30? Hmm, is that right? This ain't Whitefish Bay. Twenty-five? <laughs> Twenty? Eighteen? I'm barely making it. You ain't got to worry about me, Miss C. Oh. I ain't going out in no casket like that. Oh, thank God. I'll be in a jail cell. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't no punk. When the hood come popping off, I'm popping back. I ain't hiding on no floors. I'll take them out before they take me out. What, what are you saying, Oscar? That it's kill or be killed? Yeah. Miss Collins. What? What we telling you is we live in 53206. What's up, man? What's the mercy? It was Lavelle and his cousin Oscar. Well, how you know that? When I see them fools, it's lights out. I was just in class with them fools. Mm. Mm hmm I'm on the north side looking for that beautiful lady. Looking for you. That's a black, that's a black, that's a black. I'm on the south side looking for that beautiful lady. So what's up with your friend? She's good. I mean, what's good? What up? You ain't, you ain't going to do this? What's your Amber. name? What up, Amber? You know, chilling with y'all, right? I'm on the north side, same court side. Her dress locked in her toes. Okay, where are you trying to go after this? Show? I'm trying to go to your place. You going to take a look? Yeah, I need to talk to you, bud. Man, get off that, cuz. You good? Hey, Streets is talking. They saying that I was with you. I mean, you should have been with me. I came up, got stacks of cash, guns, and I got bricks. We winning, man. Hey, man, L.R., for real? Cuz, man, stop worrying, bro. I told you I got you. I got you, cuz. Aight? Aight. Aight. I'll see you at the courts. Aight. Back to what we were saying. Right. So, uh, what was the name Alright, let's go. Girl, you killed it. You recorded that? Yeah. It's just for me, though, to apply to Juilliard. Mm -hmm. Dang, that's Keisha. Brown's on her popping penis again. Let me go get that for her. Robs, how about you come back later? I'll fix you some chicken. Mom's going to be working late tonight. OK. All right.
later. Later. Just saw me, just saw me. Da, 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 da. What's up, Robbie? Hey. Coming to the course later? I'll try to make it. I'll see you there. Yeah. Look at that fool Oscar right there. What now? Let's go, let's go. Hey. And I've seen the light of day. If Keisha hadn't texted me, I could have been shot too. Grams pops and peanuts saved my life. Nah, some stuff about to go down. No, nah, can I take them all nah, out? I know how you feel. No, nah, he didn't deserve Not this. Here, man. Not right now. I get 25 to life! Sean, calm down, man. I get 25! Calm down, this ain't the place for oh, no. man. I know how you feel, everybody feels like that. Calm down, man. I feel like this guy. If you need any help playing the funeral. What funeral? We can't afford that. We're just now getting our lights cut back on. Why you miss? Isn't there insurance for funerals or something? Yeah, if you got a policy. But you know, Robbie, life insurance was meant for us, us old timers, so that we don't place the burden of our children burying us when we die of old age. I mean, parents burying their children, their babies that's been murdered. It ain't right, Robbie. And look at this fool, drunk as usual. Got a gang of kids of his own, but always playing with somebody else. He need to step up to the plate and be a man and take care of his own kid. Dang! Why leave them kids alone? Stop it, Dang! Let them play in peace. 
We need to have one of them barbecues. You cook some of your ribs and I'll sing. Five dollars a plate or something for Jerome's funeral. Jane! Move yourself, James. You know, Robbie, I'm always down for the barbecue. But you really don't know how much a funeral costs, do you? $10,500 at least, Robbie. Yeah, well, exactly. We'll get the whole neighborhood. Robbie, how much food do you think I got? We can get you some ribs and my Aunt Tamika can cook. Robbie, she just lost her son. I don't think she's gonna be in the mood to be cooking, Robbie. Yeah! I think she will. It'll be good for her to get out the house. Man, even if we fill up both our backyards, Robbie, we still won't make all that much. I think we will. Jane, you always get drunk. You come around here, then you want to start bothering these kids. Didn't I tell you leave them I kids alone? That's what I want to do, man. Jane, I'm not over here, you think. Not around man, these kids, man. I'm going to knock you out, dog. You ain't going to do I nothing to me. Oh. I'm tired of <sighs> talking to you. Shoot. OK, OK. You cool? OK, man. You done? You done? <laughs> Let me go, dog. Are you done? <laughs> Answer me, man. You done? <sighs> Still mad at me. Thanks for coming to the visual. I know that's not your thing. I mean, even though me and Jerome argued all the time, that was still my homeboy. We good? No, we not good. You lied to me. And you did them. I don't like when you hide things from me. So why is we doing this? To raise money for Jerome's funeral. I know that. I mean, couldn't have put it on the Booker's home? I did that. I'm going to try to talk to Miss Collins, see if she can put something up for the school to donate. I'll do some recruiting? I don't want any of your drug dealing friends there. So you got me labeled as some kingpin now? Hey, JR, I need to talk to you. What's going down? What up, Robin? Hey. How you doing? So, Big O, you was walking that way. Did you see anything? Oh, no. I heard shots, and I was gone. All right. Hey, come here, bro. What's going down? Get down. Hey, yo. What's up? I need you to get a hold of five ounces for me. How am I supposed to do that? So you telling me you ain't get a good look at the fool who jacked your bag? I won't. I mean, I seen him, but I don't even know who little dude is. So you think you're going to sell all that weed in a few days? Man, I got to. Them fools don't play. Oh my, JR and Oscar in class early. I am impressed. <laughs> well, I'm not gonna say our last class had anything to do with that, but could it be that you two gentlemen are turning the corner? That's for sure, Mrs. Collins. Yeah. That's good to hear. Hey, yo. That's good. You got an idea on who shot wrong? Talk later. Talk now. Talk. What? Man, talk. I know who it was. They were shooting at me. Hey, what? Um, excuse me, JR. Have a seat. Mrs. Collins, Oscar scored 28 points in a basketball game this weekend and didn't even bother to tell me. Is that a fact? Mm -hmm. You should've looked on the book. <laughs> okay. Hey, 
Okay, everybody have a seat quickly, please. Thank you. Usual suspects, absent or tardy, I see. And no Robbie. That's why the Boston Tea Party happened. It was in defiance of the Tea Act that Parliament imposed upon the colonists. It's going to be in the test tomorrow. It's not an open book, so make sure you study the sample test that I gave you earlier, okay? All right, everybody, the other assignment's due tomorrow, don't forget. So I'll see you over at Fasten Prim. All right, bro. Hi, Miss Collins, you got a minute? You were late again, Robbie. I know, but you'll be proud of me. Sleeping in class and not doing your homework? There's nothing to be proud of. Let me guess, is this the part where the white woman tries to save the little black child to make herself feel better? Wait a minute, you mean to tell me you're black? Who knew? Yeah, Miss Collins, yeah. Robbie, wait a minute, come back. Aren't you going to tell me why I should be proud of you? Yeah, I'm being a leader, like you said. I'm organizing a barbecue to raise money for Jerome's funeral. Five dollars a plate. We gotta help his mama. She can't afford a funeral. Maybe you can get the word out about donations. Of course. I, I'll do anything I can to help. Thank you. See you tomorrow? On time? Okay. Hey, yo, what up? What's good? So what popped off? My cousin and his friends was the ones who did the setup at Avery's house. Took their bricks and the cash. So Lavelle robbed Avery and Elrod? Yeah, that fool, crazy. So wait, why is they popping off at you? They ain't your suppliers, eh? No. All right, all right. They think I'm the other dude in the stick up because I be hanging out with my cousin all the time. How you know that? You know how the streets talk. Well, man, you gotta clean this mess up. Yeah, you owe them fools a lot of money. You ain't got nothing I can hold down. Not that kind of money. It's all I got right now. Good looking. Oh. Love. So how's JR? He upset and mad like everybody else. Girl, he's so fine. So you gonna get with him or what? <laughs> uh-uh. He is just a friend. I am not trying to mess with his drug dealer self. Well, at least he got some money to take you out with. I'm not even trying to hear that right now. You better get him before I do. <laughs> <laughs> so, how's Tamika? I was thinking she can cook some of her chicken for the barbecue. Robbie, her son just died. She ain't finna be doing no cooking. But she likes to cook. It'll be good for her to be around everybody. She need to be fundraising for her own son. What you mean? She ain't got no money for no funeral. We on our way over there now. I didn't even realize my own cousin might not be getting a proper funeral. Everything just happening so fast here. All right, y'all. We kind of running out of time. We got to figure out how to make this happen. So what do y'all suggest we do? I think we should all put our money together as a family. Well, I mean, yeah, that's kind of why we're here. But we got to figure out how much that's going to be first. Matter of fact, how much does the policy cover? That's what I've been trying to tell you. Policy expired. Wait, hold up. How does that happen? All you had to do was make the payments. I don't understand how you let that happen. You working, ain't you? You're supposed to be the responsible one. I didn't expect for my kid to get shot either. Keisha, leave her alone. Oh, I know you not talking. I'm the one that got to go in my pocket and spend my money. What are you doing? I'm going to do the best I can do for my family. Exactly. No thoughts. I need everybody to actually come with some ideas and stop looking at me and spending my money for me. That's can all we, I'm saying. Can we ask mama for the money? 
No, we can't ask mama. Cause mama ain't gonna do nothing but ask me. And then we right back here. I can't keep coming up my pocket. You know what? I'm just simply saying, everybody come together. Don't look at me for all the answers. I'm tired of Don't fixing worry it about all. It. Don't worry about it. I'll fix it. Cause remember, it happened to me. No, boo boo. It happened to us. That was ugly. Well, I was thinking, maybe we can add one more beneficiary to the barbecue. Baby, you can't raise enough money for both me and Doris in just one barbecue. Guess we'll just have to sell place to the neighborhood. It's just not enough time. Well, how much did Michelle say the funeral was gonna cost? You don't know? Haven't you been a piss to find out? It's been over a week. Well, look, I was thinking you can cook some of your famous fried chicken for the barbecue Friday. And see some good. Sure, I'm cooking. Okay. That was five ounces. That ain't that much. Why you trying to play me? Man, things are going slow. Slow? What you mean, slow? What? People ain't getting high in the 53206? Everybody in rehab or something? <laughs> Yo, we ain't playing out here. If you ain't got the money by Friday, that's a wrap, dog. Look, look, look. Y'all gotta give me this weekend. That's when the parties be jumping and everything be slamming. Monday. Anybody. Hey, if I tell you, I got the kids, baby. Well, you can give me $5 and I'll stamp you in. I seriously forgot, but as soon as I finish these, I'm gonna go home and go get it. Mm-hmm. We have to be here. Tamika never showed. We even pour it now for having the event. I told you, you gotta be aggressive with these people. Tell them that these places $5. Everybody in here is eating for free. What am I supposed to do? Then ain't nobody gonna eat. What's wrong with you? Nothing, I'm good. Thanks for coming and eating up all the food and not contributing a dime or caring about Jerome, or Darren, or this community. Come on, Tamika, I know you live there. Tamika. Tamika. You didn't show up, that's not like you. My daughter brought her son over and disappeared again. Why does she do that? No. What's up, Darius? What's wrong with him? He got a rash or something? Just bugs. Bed bugs? Here, yeah, these slumlords don't care. Roaches, bed bugs, just nasty. 
that's just, I don't even know. Anyway, how'd the barbecue go? Nothing. But I figured something out. Is you gonna be okay? Mm. I don't know. I love you. <laughs> yeah, any donation would be greatly appreciated. No, I'm not trying to donate. I was asking you if you wanted to. Hello? Hello? Hey, baby. How about getting me some popping peanuts? Thanks, Jackie. Mm -hmm. Uh, listen, I'm sorry to bother you with this. See, my friend and my cousin, they don't... There's no money for the funeral. I'm taking donations, but um, it don't have to be big. Anything is accepted. Uh, I'm not sure I have very much cash in the register right now, but... Uh... It's okay. Um, thanks anyway. But I have a better idea, though. Every hour I need thee Oh, bless me now, my Savior. I come to thee. You know, these words are true for Brother Wilson here. Brother Wilson gave his life at an early age to the Lord, so he knows the Lord. He's not dead. Let the dead bury the dead, amen? Amen. We're talking about a spiritual amen. death here. Brother Wilson died at a senseless crime. Mother Wilson, I just want you to know that it's okay to mourn. Because the Bible says, Blessed are they who mourn, for they shall be comforted. Amen? Amen. amen. And now I'd like to introduce a young lady who's known Brother Wilson for most of his life. Uh, Sister Robbie, could you come up and say a few words, please? Take your time. Hi, everybody. First, I would like to thank the owners of Fast and Friendly for making this all possible. Thanks to them, my cousin Darren will also be having his funeral. Dear Mr. President, my name is Roberta Hattie Cole. I am named after my mother and my grandmother, oh, but everyone geez. calls me Robbie. I wonder if you know where I am right now. Probably not. I'm sitting at my friend Jerome's funeral. He was shot in the head three days ago. He was only 17. Shootings happen all day, every day here in my zip code. Mr. President, last year, we had a total of 153 homicides here in Milwaukee. We are already at 111 right now this year. At this time now, the last and final viewing is going to take place. And we're Milwaukee is not a large enough city to have all of this crime. Until you have been directed to do we so. have a falling population of 250,000 black residents. Sir, I am 10 times more likely to be shot by a bullet than in any other large city. I have not told anyone what I am about to tell you. While most of my friends have come to the conclusion that they will not make it out of Milwaukee before adulthood, I have not. I don't want to die. I have resolved to live. Mr. President, I have decided to be a famous singer. I am determined to go to Juilliard to study music. I want to play the piano and sing to sold out audiences across the world. Will you help me? Will you send help to save us? Please, Mr. President, please save us. Can't thank you enough. 
I just don't know what to say. That said everything. I'm just so grateful right now. Thank you so much. The service is absolutely You sure you don't want to ride with us? Yeah, my auntie take Okay. See y'all later. Come on, auntie. Let's move over here. Yeah. 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 Don't fall. All right. Robbie, you should just let him rest. I'm not gonna bother him. Excuse me, can I please see J.R. Daniels? Hey, how you feeling? You okay? Oh, Fuzzy. Yo, head cricket. Huh? Come here. Oh, you gonna fix it? Yeah. I'm done. Mm -hmm. The violence. I'm done. You are. Yeah, we gotta get the community together. A peace rally. I'm gonna get everybody. I'm in. Hey! Hey, excuse me. You guys probably don't remember me, but... I don't remember you, but I remember your aunt. She's the one that yelled at us and think we didn't care. Yeah, sorry about that. That's okay, you have to apologize, I get it. People are upset because people are getting slaughtered out here every day and people want justice. But we get no cooperation from the community, though. Well, a good way to start is, like my auntie said, with the baseball card. We're having the Save Our Streets event Saturday at Rose Park. You guys should come. Bring other cops, bring baseball cards. Let's buy some baseball cards. Okay. Okay. No great love. No great love. No great love. But I think that this would be the best possible PR for the church, Pastor Turner. No great love. Well, when can you get back to me? Next week. But the SOS event is Saturday. Really? You'll be there? Thank you. Robbie! Miss Amen? I'm Mrs. Collins. Oh, okay. I'll see if you Nice to meet you, too. Hi. Hi. Um, TC Keisha, this is my teacher, Miss Collins. Yeah, we kind of did that already. Yeah. You're just a little late. Oh. All right. Nice to meet you. You too. Take care. What are you doing here? Well, I printed out 500 of the flyers that you sent me. They're all yours. Thank you. I really appreciate it. And I might even help you hand some of those out. In this neighborhood? Why not? I'm just playing. You can come okay. with me. <laughs> you can come with me, and we'll get the word out.
Not as many people I was hoping for. And Pastor Turner ain't nowhere to be found. As always. Look, remember when I had told you about the police officers and the baseball card? Yeah. Look, look. How you doing? Hi. We're dropping these off. Wait, what? Thanks, have a good day. Are y'all serious? <sighs> they just don't get it at all. Forget them. You ready to sing? Come on. Wait. Hello? Wait, what? Stop playing. What's wrong? Dude, you lying. All right, all right, here I come, here I come. We gotta go, we gotta find Keisha. JR, what's wrong? We gotta go to the police station. I'm here for you, cuz. We having a peace rally, and he kills two people? I'm not saying it's justified, but he did it to protect. You don't solve violence with just more violence? Avery and Elrod would've killed me, and you know it. I'm not even trying to hear this. Oscar's my best friend. Milwaukee police are investigating a homicide that took place in the 200 block of East Wright Street on August 27th. The 30-year-old Milwaukee man was... Marvin, you got some mail. Dang. I forgot to pay my phone bill. Nope. Don't look like a bill. Thank you, Nicole, for that report. We'll it's from Juilliard. It must be some Milwaukee advertising police thing. Are investigating a fatal shooting oh, my gosh. The Where's the remote? Can we please watch something other than the homicide right now? Responded to an alley near 28th and Liz. Police say a woman was taken to the hospital but was pronounced dead upon arrival. Huh? What, baby girl? It's from Juliet. I don't understand. It says I passed the pre-screening process. They want me to come and audition. I thought you didn't want to apply. I didn't. Jerome, what's up? He said he wasn't recording. He submitted my application without telling me. So you gonna go? I don't know. You should go. Girl, get up out of here. You missing nothing in Milwaukee? Jerome did you a favor. You should do it for Jerome. Keisha, you wait one minute now. That's my baby now. I'm just saying. Has to get up out of here, huh? Can't pass that one up. Yeah, but I feel like we just started getting momentum for change, and I'm just gonna abandon everybody. You can still change by singing and showing them what we about in the 53206. Wow. I know you don't think murder is justified. And I'm really sorry about the way that I acted. I ain't say I was sorry. You want to come with me to Fast and Friendly to get Grimm's popping peanuts? Not really. All right, well, I'm out. Be safe. All right, Robs. See you at Pitts in the morning. Pitts? Yeah, Darren's film. I'm sorry. I really, really am. That's cool. JR. What's up? You ever wonder why us? Why are we suffering? Why is Milwaukee the worst place for black people to live? I guess I never really thought about it, you know? I mean, we were born in this war zone, so it seemed normal. But it's not normal, JR. 
Things don't gotta be the way they are. Well, if you got a magic formula to change the 53206, I advise you to share it. We need everyone. We need the whole world to help us. We need... Robbie, what are you doing? Robbie, Robbie, wait! Robbie! Robbie, it's been another shoe note. Ninth and ring. I need an ambulance right away. I don't know, it's just blood everywhere. I don't know if it's from her chest or her back. I just need an ambulance right away, please. Okay. I'm going to Julia. I'm going to Julia. I'm going to Julia. Keisha! I'm going to Julia. I'm going to Julia. Oh my God. Ke Rabbi, where are you I'm hurt? Julia. Where is that blood coming from? I'm dying. I'm dying. It's okay, oh Rabbi. Rabbi, it's going to be okay. Oh my God. Rabbi, <laughs> it's not her blood. Oh my God. Oh, baby, baby, yes. We're going to Julia. You're going to Julia. Hey, Earl. Hey, what's up, baby girl? Can you come to Graceland with me? For sure. All right, I remember when Heidi first brought you home. <laughs> we all came to welcome you. Man, and did you have a set of pipes on you, Rob? We pass you around like hot potato, and you just cried and cried. The only thing that soothed you was the music. But look at you now, almost grown. Man, how time fly by. I remember, boy, when y'all used to run around the neighborhood. My heart is pounding. It's gonna be all right. Just take your time. I'm here for you, Rob. We're going to have another one of them SOS events Saturday. Bigger and better. Man, Rams, I'm having a hard time. Oscar definitely don't deserve this. What's the reason why he over there? Yeah, them fools Avery and L-Rod. Nah, so you was the one going to the dudes for the plug. That's on you. 
What? Man, my cousin Oscar ain't gonna be sitting in no jail without no money on his books. I know, and I wish there was something I could do to help him. It is something you can do. I'm gonna make sure you sell all this. See, now, now this gotta end. I'm done. Can I have everyone's attention, please? I would like to thank everybody for coming out. Well, Robbie started here with the Save Our Streets is to show that peace can happen in the 53206. And I believe it can. Like that, what? Why? What? JR. Look. You and Jerome had them dreams of going to Juilliard and singing in front of sold out crowds. I mean, be 100. How many people you know made it out of the 53206? You my best friend. How I go our whole lives without me knowing you had them pipes on you? Forget you know it. Boy, why are you? Avery and Elrod gone. You owe somebody else some money? Well, no. I'm not even playing. Last time you lied to me, you ended up in the hospital. Look, I'm not going back to school. I'm done. I got to get out here and get my way up. Dale, what you talking about? Oscar thought he was helping, but he just signed our death certificates. Avella saying this is my fault. Now I got to go out here and ride for him and keep money on Oscar's books. But keep your head up, girl. You see what you're doing with these SOS events? I mean, not so bad for your second time around, huh? Almost got the whole neighborhood. I'm not going to Juilliard. This decides it. I'm going to stay and I'm going to help you sell. Give me what you got. You're not no dealer. It don't matter. You're not going to get shot again. Robbie, get out of here. Go, go to Juilliard. Make the 53206 proud. Make Milwaukee proud. Let's do it. You and me, come on. We're going to go and we're going to help ourselves. We're going to come back and help everybody else. Come on.
All right. All right. We got this. Day after day, it gets tougher Coping with the things I see How much longer will we suffer? Will you help restore the Shamari, Kimate, Terry, Devante, and Dante. Kirby, Cabani, Paris, David, Travis, and Anthony. Zalea, Tanaya, Ladria, Bruce, Robert, Damarion, Alexandria, Judy, and Kurt. Taze, Eric, and London. Diamond, Wesley, Daniel, Ramon, and Melanie. Marquel, Alec, Justin, Kian, Javante, Jessica, Odysseus, Lazarus, Andre, and Sean. Marvin, and Madison. We all miss you a lot. Jelani, Antonio. Frank, Cornell, and Benny, and Billy, Dorian, Stephen, and Tyrone, and Keyshawn, Shamare, and Earl, and Warren, and Paris, Jeffrey, Michael, Jahara, Nibelo, Dion. Trey and 